Good morning, sis. If you are new here, welcome. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you aren't new here, hey sis, welcome back to those words. So y'all, today is the startup vlog of my girl's trip, okay? Now my alarm is gonna go off in probably like 10 minutes literally because it is 4.50, I got my alarm to five o'clock, it's 4.50, I see I gotta check in on my flight. The flight starts boarding at 6.45, so we gonna be there early, we're gonna leave out at 5.15. It's like a 10 minute drive from the airport to, um, I mean from my house to the airport or whatever. It's me and my friend, I'ma let y'all meet her. And then um, we wanna be there like a little bit, like a little early or whatever, so we could get some Starbucks and all of that. I've been up, I took my nap, like I took a nap at like probably like nine-ish and I woke up at like 12.30 ever since then I just been up. Cause I didn't wanna oversleep, like do it with the, like overdo it with the sleeping because I do wanna sleep on a flight. The flight is four hours. So I do wanna sleep for that time period cause I don't, I don't know. I just want to sleep because we're going to be up that whole entire day after we land and stuff like that. I will check in time. Now it's a three. We're going to get there like around 11 or 12 or something like that. And it's no early check-in. So we're just going to be up walking and stuff like that. So I just need to, you know, have some energy. If I was to sleep through that whole night and not on a ride on a plane thing, I would have been annoyed when I got off that plane. You feel me? So, yeah. I know myself. So, without further ado, we about to get dressed. I'm gonna brush my teeth one more time. I don't know if I should wear my bonnet to the airport or if I just if if I should just take this bonnet off because I do have a bonnet pack with me. If I just if I should just take this bonnet off and just leave my elastic band on and then just be in the airport like that. I'm not sure. I probably would take it off because it's probably it's interrupting my fit. You know. Yeah. And it's too early. You never know who you can see. <laughs> say nah. Say nah. Say nah. But. Let's get ready because enough talking. It's 4.53 now. We only got like probably 10 minutes and stuff. And my friend mom drive fast. So I can't be playing, yo. I can't be playing. So we about to get ready. Yay. We back, sis. So I didn't even get changed until the alarm went off because I just wanted to... I just wanted to add that for it, period. <laughs> but now what we about to do is we about to rush and get ready. So I'm about to show y'all what I'm wearing. Show y'all the little airport fit. And see if y'all fucking with it or if y'all not fucking with it. And nine times out of ten, actually ten times out of ten, y'all gonna fuck with it because you know your girl be out here fucking styling and motherfucking profiling on a motherfucking con. You feel me? Had to cop the Barbie Crocs, you know. So my look today is gonna be a Barbie inspired look, meaning I'm gonna be wearing basically all pink with a little pop of color because I love Barbie. That's what we're gonna really be wearing. So if y'all see too much pink, mind your business. I really wanted the other um the the slip on ones where you could show your feet out or whatever, cause your girl feet is cute as fuck. But they didn't have none of my size. They had some in like men's size. They just did not have my size at all. And I really wanted the platform ones too. Again, I got the release mad late, so I didn't even know Barbie was collabing with Crocs at all. So yeah. But let me hurry up and show y'all the outfit, cause now it is. 502. Oh shit, it's 502, y'all. Let's hurry up. Let's hurry up. Okay, y'all. So hopefully y'all can see me. So today what we're gonna be wearing is this two-piece loungewear set. But it's like a skims dupe, but it's a black owned brand, and it just says that girl is bubblegum pink. Real tall girl friendly, like too long for me. Like y'all gonna see when I got it on. It's too long. I'm probably because I'm short, and then it's the little top with my crops I showed y'all earlier. And then to top it off. We gonna pair it with some Lorve. It's like these, the big ones from the Sweetheart Collection. We gonna rock them. And then, as far as purse, I got my Palm Angels bag. I'm gonna wear it with this. Just to pop a pop of color because I don't wanna over overdo it with the pink. As far as perfume scents, I'm thinking Oriana by Perfume de Marley. Or we gonna do Valentino. This Born in Rome Intense, meaning that should be strong. So you only need like one or two sprays and then call it the day. So as y'all can see, we doing a whole pink look, pink perfume, pink everything. Everything gonna be pinked out, cause yeah. So let's get dressed. Breaking news, got me breaking, 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 breaking. I was present, hopeless, praying, 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 praying. Struck down at 20, plenty left people behind you. You ain't peak, devil's peaking, not a speaking about you. So as y'all can see, we are dressed now. What we have to do now is this 
Palm Angels bag to the one I showed y'all earlier. So let's do, we gotta put everything that's in here, in here. Just always carry my little backup from ear pods. Now I kept my most important things in here, my car key and my other ID because I don't wanna lose that. Oh, okay, okay, I'll be done. So y'all, that was key, so 520, good. So we, let me get a rubber band and make this like a fanny pack and then yeah, I'm gonna come back. Okay, y'all, so I'm back. I got to get it like this a little fanny pack or whatever. I'm gonna pair it with this, just in case if it's a little chilly. We are literally good to go, y'all. I'm gonna probably try to show y'all a closer up of my outfit when I get to the actual airport. I'm gonna get key to record for y'all. But right now, we are done. I'm gonna get back to y'all when I get to the airport. See y'all in a few minutes. Hey y'all, so we're finally at the airport. Me and Kia, we're currently at Starbucks. We was going through a lot because we had to get, um, both our carry-on bags had to get checked, but they let us through. And we got, we got the juice, so we got passed pretty, we got, we had to, we got to cut in front of everybody. Yeah, cause we got the juice, period. And we about to just get us some breakfast cause our gate is literally over there. And we about to just eat before we board. And then yeah, y'all. Unfortunately, Kia would not be sitting next by us because she wanted to be delayed with her flight ticket. So Kia won't be sitting by us. But definitely when we get to actually Puerto Rico, y'all gonna see more stuff, all our outfits and stuff like that. So without further ado, just stay tuned because we about to just get Starbucks. That's it, not in Asia. And yeah, because don't nobody got the juice like us. Dang, my stuff 14:31. Okay, y'all. See you soon, Dolly. Y'all, all we doing is waiting for our, um, we literally waiting for our Starbucks. Key, what you order? A donut and a mocha cookie crumble with extra caramel drizzle. I got my stuff with cinnamon on top. <laughs> and this, look at this. This is disgusting. Any other time my stuff be good, this is really disgusting. Y'all, I'm gonna catch y'all when we probably on a plane or whatever, cause this food is disgusting and I'm really upset now. Hey y'all, so we're back. As you guys can see, we're clearly not on a plane because our plane got delayed. So our new departure time will be 8 8.40, but we were supposed to be boarding at 8.05 and as y'all can see, we still ain't bored. Like, it's just really getting ridiculous. They're gonna say that the airline, when they turned on the air, they smelled something. The whole time it's hot as shit on that plane. We just waiting until we can get back on the plane, y'all. And then once we get back on the plane, I'm gonna turn back on the cameras because, well, I probably don't, because we're super tired. This is honestly ridiculous and I'm tired. <laughs> now, y'all, honestly, we're all United girls. We don't do JetBlue. Mm -hmm. So for this to be our first JetBlue experience, and it's like, this is kinda, I'm gonna just stick to United and stick to what the fuck I know. Cause this ain't what I know. So, again, I'm gonna catch y'all in a little bit or in a few hours. I don't know. Many hours later. Hey y'all, uh, after several hours, we finally landed and it is now um, 1.34. Our ride is outside to pick us up, so we about to just head out. I finally got some good rest on a plane, but my body and stuff was cramping so bad so so bad but get checking early out early which is good so we about to drop our bags off and we about to just go get some food like this because we already have an itinerary made for us any restaurants or stuff that we go to i'm gonna make sure i put it on the screen or i'm gonna show y'all it so y'all won't have to ask questions like what is this restaurant and what is that restaurant because i know how that could get aggravating and if people don't respond so we're gonna make sure every restaurant and all of that everything we do is gonna be on the screen because we don't gatekeep so I'm gonna get to y'all when we probably at the Airbnb. Are you for Nello? Hmm? Yeah, how you like the view? 
Amazing. Amazing. The view is nice. Can't get this in Newark. <laughs> can't get this in the hood. You know that? You can't get this type of shit in the hood. Like this shit right here, luxury to us. Like, y'all, it is so, 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 so hot. It's so hot. Like, you literally breathe in fucking heat. Y'all, this is the Airbnb that we're staying in. So it actually smelled really great. It's actually really small though, but it's just perfect for like, even if you're by yourself, you won't be scared of none of that. Like, yes, the house is a really nice little spot for just you and like two people, honestly. Like, if you was to break an extra guest, I think that would definitely be dragging it. But this house is really nice. We are actually about to, we're not even going to change our clothes. We're actually about to go eat because the both of us is damn near starving. But we probably do a Walmart run and then come back and then switch into like our bathing suits and all of that. Y'all, we waiting for our Uber to go to a restaurant i don't know the direct name but when we get there i will put it on it we notice it's not really luxury out here it's just really historic and stuff out here it's not really like a luxury type of vibe so yeah he come in seven minutes actually six now yeah whoever said you could drive in puerto rico yeah whoever puerto rico said was y you can't drive in puerto rico because them streets like this small i know where i'm from i'm from the ghetto the hood i don't know where y'all from but you can't i'd rather drive in new york than a Puerto Rico. I'm just saying. And the traffic lights are not working. I'm okay. <laughs> the, the traffic lights wasn't working. Did you see? <laughs> I'm like, oh, they don't got traffic lights. And y'all, these are Lorve by Diara. She have good quality glasses. Between her and Jada, they the only celebrities who have good quality stuff. So, yeah, I'm gonna catch y'all when we get to the restaurant. Tell me there's a So we finally got here, but it's like a wait, and it's ain't no way. We're hungry as fuck. Y'all, Kia found this new spot for us because because that other one was like a two-hour wait, and we literally just got off a flight. We're hungry as fuck, but it's look it's given that all these restaurants are like a long as wait, and it's just not what we used to, and it's starting to piss me off. But y'all, I'm gonna come back on the camera when we actually sit down sit down somewhere and actually could eat our food or order because it's it's not given right now not at all we're really upset and hangry i think this whole trip we about to be in rice and chicken rice We're gonna review the food. They look crispy, but they're not crispy. Thank you. This is a real potato Yeah, just authentic. Try the rice. Mmm, that rice good. I poured a little bit of the beans on there. Mm. I'm not gonna do the beans because it tastes like lime and I hate when my stuff tastes like lime. But it's good. It just tastes like Spanish food. I hate the lime. And the pepper. Mm -hmm. This restaurant, in my opinion, is a seven out of ten. The rice is good. Y'all, we're about to go to this ice cream and icy cart. Well, Kia gonna get the icy cart. I'm gonna go to the ice cream spot. And it's all in the same direction. I know I told y'all that the food, we told y'all that it was like a 7.5 or a 7 out of 10. No, it wasn't. That 
shit was actually like a four out of five and them drinks was watered down it was just disgusting but it is it was cheap as fuck but just no no I, uh -uh. I hope later on for dinner the food is actually good as shit because that spot wasn't where we were originally supposed to go so i hope so Y'all, we are currently in Walmart in San Juan and it's not giving again. Like, I don't know what this is. I feel like San Juan is more so a historic spot rather than like a girl's trip type of vibe. It's real historic. Like you can learn a lot from the history and all of that. But boo, your girl got asthma. And this ain't for the week. I'm tired, y'all. Many hours later. Y'all, so we about to go to Canado Beach. I think that's how you pronounce it. And I'm about to look in my suitcase and see which type of bathing suit look I'm going to wear. So, honestly, again, I'm still in my menstrual. So, we're not about to be um really in the water or anything. Neither one of us really like the beach water. And they did say be aware that that water is like, the waves is really dangerous. So... Yeah, we're just going on the beach just to take a little few flicks and then we're going to be back here because we do have a dinner reservation. So I think I'm going to do something really, really common. As far as like, I didn't plan it out. I didn't think, what am I going to wear like when I'm getting an Uber to go to the beach? Like, I don't have no for my cover ups. So, yeah. But, we about to see. My uh, ah! So, again, if y'all ain't hear what I said, I don't really know the vibe at this beach since we're not actually like gonna be chilling for real at this beach we about to just go there and take photos like photo work so i'm about to just see which one of my bathing suits are giving plain jane well i'm actually just gonna see which bathing suit i want to take a photo in right now because i want to take a photo in all my bathing suits actually because they all do serve looks so that's what you guys are gonna do look at all of this once I unpack this, I'm not going to be able to close it back because my mammy packed it for me. So, y'all, I'm not being colorful right now. I'm going to be plain Jane, like I told y'all. So, I'm going to wear black and white. I'm going to wear black and white, y'all. Because I'm honestly tired, so I feel like when you wear black and white, you could be a little chill. Versus if I had on the colorful colors, I'm going to have to, like, really strike a pose and shit. And I just can't do that as of right now. So, my cover up. My little sandals. Y'all gonna come back when I got the whole outfit ready because I gotta look through this and see where my mom packed everything at. Cause my mom packed it so I honestly don't know. So yeah, I'll be back soon. In a bit when I have my full outfit ready. All my young boys round me street Get money and fuck these hoes Where we learn these values I, I know who can tell you I'm just kinda I'm the reason not to go out every evening I need someone that can help me Be with someone besides myself I someone I need to find Kia's gonna give y'all a sneak peek of her outfit later Um, y'all can probably sort of see what I'm doing But y'all can't really see us down bottom So, we gonna get back to y'all When we at the beach a photo dump because we about to just take mad hella photos i'm a photographer key a photographer bitch we ain't buy this camera for nothing now just let us get in our uber and stuff like that once we get at the beach i'm gonna tap back into y'all y'all we are at this spot we was originally going to the beach but the man dropped us up to the wrong place so now we found this other spot it do look like it gets beach vibes or whatever it's a big pile of water so we're going to take our photos right there instead and then get a little shirley temple take our photos and then go home so what's your order? Shirley Temple, no ice. She's gonna get a Shirley Temple. I'm gonna get a Shirley Temple as well. I don't wanna try nothing else new here and be felt. Everybody say I look Ethiopian, and I'm starting to see it. I'm not being delusional. Every African Uber driver say I look Ethiopian. But I do be looking like I have a part of African, that African side in me. I do look like that. But I'm black. And um, <laughs> mixed with bad bitch. <laughs> So this I drink. Uh, I did start drinking mine, y'all. I've been parched. How is this? It's good. It's good. Okay. I got an obsession with lime. 
I do. Kia only likes stuff for drinks. She's plain as shit. You know, seafood is something you really have to crave. I know all females be like, the majority of females be like, I love seafood. I love seafood. I like seafood. I don't love it. Like, I just can't eat it all the time. Like, it just, you gotta be in a mood for seafood. Kia only wanted it for the fucking drinks. We gonna catch y'all when we about to take our fix. for four to five people. She wanted to be fucking Miss Almighty. Oh, uh, we're saving money, this, that, and the third. So no, I'm like, all right, cool. No, she suggested it to me. So what was I going to do? This was Puerto Rico herself, the <laughs> don't tour guy. No, 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 no. She said she was doing her research Don't put, don't put that on my name. First of all, we did. We couldn't even eat the shit. We couldn't eat the shit for real. But you that's the only. That's the only spot so far that food that they food is decent. Like, if I had to, I probably would eat it again. But this shit is just too much. It's just too much. But I hope. Focus. I hope the burger, burger and mayo place is good because I'm actually excited about that. Make them drinks and the burgers. I don't understand how somebody can fuck up a burger. So, and I think we so go there. One place you went to that took oh, they right? did fire and oak. Yeah, that was. But hopefully they don't do that shit because I'm just like, yeah. I think we both in the mood to ready to fucking go. But back to Miss Sixty Dollars, she wanted to fucking. She say, suggested it to me, y'all. So what was I going to do? Tell her, say no? She made it seem like it was a good deal. So I'm like, all right, let's do. It. <laughs> no shade, y'all. That shit was a good deal though because. Think about it. If it's you come with, it's for four to five people serving. If you come with five people, divide that shit by sixty. What is that? Twelve. That's twelve dollars. But technically, he warned us though, and Kia's still like, yeah, yeah. She was right there agreeing with me, y'all. So. Girl, no, the fuck, I wasn't. She, girl, no. she was right there. So how did you get it? So you gonna act like you? Yo, I just, I said, Kia, ooh, you want this? She's like, yeah, 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 yeah. She should have knew the shit was too much when it mentioned three fucking meats. We currently waiting for the Uber, which is one minute away, and then we're gonna get in the Uber. Can't wait to get go home. But y'all, we're gonna catch y'all probably when we in the house or probably tomorrow. <laughs> y'all, we finally made it in the house. That concludes today, which is August 4th on Friday. We rate this day two out of ten. Like, it was terrible. Kia said a one out of ten. I'm gonna give it a two out of ten benefit of the doubt. It was really terrible. Like the best part was when we took our photos and stuff. The drinks was good. Everything was just good. Photos and all of that. 
that was the best part actually i'm about to get on the phone and see if they could probably change our flight a little early because we both have travel insurance so i'm about to see what i could do make a little make up a little lie because they delayed our flight twice which messed up our itinerary yeah. so we couldn't go home yeah. i mean so we can't even do the rest of our plans because make up a good lie because well the delaying of the flight ain't no lie but we ready to go we could have been in new york having way more fun like it's just not giving. I could say that they definitely are cheap as fuck out here, but it's just not giving like what TikTok makes it give. It's just not giving that. So I'm gonna, I don't know. They got the close up. It's this little cherry dress with my Palm Angels bag. The Palm Angels don't match, but boo, I wasn't trying to find no more bags or whatever. I'm telling you, I'm really over the whole trip. So I didn't even really care about the outfit. But y'all, we probably. Like I said, we about to just chill. Not about to be nothing major. Um, We literally got to wake up at like 8 a.m. or something like that for brunch. Because brunch is at 9 o'clock. So we got to really wake up early. Hopefully we got a reservation for it. Because if not, I'm going to see if I can make us a reservation now. If we did have to make a reservation, nine times out of 10, the travel agent did that. They wait times here. be ridiculous. We learned that lesson today. So, yeah. Bye, sis. See you in the morning. Good morning, sis. Today is now Saturday, and I literally just woke up. Kia been up for some time. And what we currently about to do is get ready for breakfast. It's not brunch. We about to get ready for breakfast. So right now, I'm just taking out my outfits or whatever to see. What, well, I know what I'm going to wear. I'm going to wear like a regular two-piece set. And later on, we're going to do ATV riding and horseback riding. So we got time for that. We got time. When we come back, we're going to have time in between or whatever so i'm gonna come back and do all of that i really can't wait to do the atv ride thing because yeah i just never did that before and <laughs> i just never did that before and i'm just excited to do that and also horseback riding i'm not gonna lie i am excited to do that as well i wish i wasn't scared of zip lining because everybody say zip lining here is like really the best thing but boo ain't gonna take no chances but we got to be to breakfast at 9 o'clock, and it is currently, um, y'all probably can't see, but it's, oh, y'all could, it's 8.13, so, I'm about to get in the shower, Q already got in the shower, I'm the one behind, so, I got rapid oats. Let me show y'all a quick thing, what I'm wearing. I'm going to be wearing this set, this is shorts, these glasses, some little gold jewelry, gold jewelry this a little top oh the hair on the shirts this the top part this because i don't the, both of the oranges that's probably just too much yeah time to get back on the camera when we probably about to head out y'all i'm on the phone with my mom so yeah i'm gonna get back to y'all when we in an uber We just made it back to the Airbnb so we could hurry up, get dressed and stuff like that, and get our outfits together. Well, I think the both of us know what we're going to wear for um, horseback riding and ATV riding. So we just made it back. Um, it's literally 10.24. The food, it wasn't that um, much of a hype. Like, I just couldn't really get with it, get with it how I wanted to. So we're about to go back in the house. I just be so happy like the airbnb definitely was a great choice like if the air and everything feels good um 
the rooms small but it feel good we slept we did go to sleep y'all and we slept I, I slept good Kia said she slept good girl i was knocked out like 10 out of 10. i needed that i needed it i just can't wait to go back to sleep <laughs> atv riding so and horseback riding because i made sure i planned out all of that when i was home so i don't really need the brush and we just got out the shower before we went to brunch so i don't really have to rush wait what time is it actually 10 27 so mm. y'all just can't wait for these type of looks because i really did put some creativity in these looks and that restaurant that we just came from i rated a three out of ten like i know i'm a picky eater but there's no way a picky eater could like i i could eat i never get felt in my own state or new york and houston and atlanta i never got felt so there's no way but i talked to my grandfather my grandfather and mother and aunt said that it's a whole better spot in Puerto Rico that probably suit our needs and like what we aiming for it, but we just can't find it. So if you ever wanted to come out here for like a luxury vibe, so far that's not it. I'll just go to Miami. What you think? I second that. She's a little camera shy, y'all, so. I think we about to just chill and wait because we don't have to rush and get ready yet. Hopefully, our tour guide, not the tour guide, but the lady who will be providing our transportation while we're out here, hopefully, she's on time to get us because today is the shit. We got to be there by, we got to be there 45 minutes before, so hopefully. Or oh, they can't send our stuff, so. I'm going to stop being delusional. I'm going to get ready now. I'm going to stop being delusional because I don't want to be the last one. Yeah. Personally, I'm me, I don't got to start getting ready now because I could get ready fast. Yeah, so I'm not going to be the delusional one. I'm going to get ready. Tomorrow, if we have time, we have to run to the mall because I don't have no airport outfit back. I don't know why I just never packed one. I forgot. So, yeah. So, I'm going to come back on the camera when I'm doing my makeup. Okay, y'all. So, I just got finished doing my makeup. Currently, I have the setting powder still on my face. I did not wipe it off. So, if y'all see a little ash or something, that's because the setting powder is still on my face. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, while this is setting on my face, um, I'm going to start getting dressed for the ATV riding. This is the scarf. I don't know if I showed y'all in my previous video, but this is a scarf because uh, you know you gotta wrap your head up and stuff. And here, ah! oh my God. Here are my shorts that I'll be wearing. And on the butt part, it says that girl, cause that's who I am. And then the top part is like a little, I showed y'all already in a previous video, but if y'all did not watch that video, go watch that video. But if y'all didn't, I'll still show y'all right here. Is this you have this top it's like a little corset part and you tie this around your neck and then as far as accessories I'm not really doing accessories I do have on a little silver anklet but that's just just because um and then I got my Lord Vey um I think this is the cry about it pair um the cry about it shades honestly I really wanted the black goggles uh type of glasses that they wear to the ATV ride thing but I just could not find nothing that really suit my style and that I really liked it. So I just got some of Diera. Cry about it. Lorve, I just packed them. They're black. So which should really be cute with the outfit. And then as far as shoes, I am I do have so much jewelry, but I just don't know what type of jewelry I would wear with this. I do need a necklace because my neck is gonna be out. So I may try to find like a little necklace or whatever. As far as sneakers, I'm gonna wear my Adidas, the y'all already know the aesthetic ones. Boom. It's gonna be really cute. And today's perfume scent is gonna be the My Way by Armani or something like that. I don't have the big two, but I think I showed y'all earlier. Um, I think I showed y'all in a previous video or earlier, so it's the My Way. I got that little small two. We're gonna wear probably pink sugar and My Way. We're gonna layer this shit. Fuck you talking about. So I'm coming back on camera when I'm about to get dressed, y'all, because I need to find like a necklace for my neck. When you never know what you want to wear. Now, y'all, we about to go to ATV Ride, and we waiting for our driver to pick us up. And, yeah, I got on a Lord Vey. I'm going to show y'all Kia when she come out her room, because don't go in other people's room unless they tell you to. So, I do respect that. Um, we both just have on something calm. We have on a two-piece set with sneakers, because we got to wear sneakers. <laughs> this is Kia. Again, to be riding dirty. Okay. 
Okay, we'll give her that. That she's gonna be riding dirty. You know, you gotta make sure you got your license on you. Yeah, license. I got my license. Okay, so you, you got your glasses? Oh, I'm done with glasses. I'm done. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is how you know she's not on vacay. Because when we're in state, that's all she want to wear is glasses. But now since we out of state, in heat, she don't want to wear glasses. She only wear glasses in the winter and fall times. I don't understand that. But I'm just giving a different vibe right now. Okay, okay. So we're going to get uh, OOTD for the both of us probably. So... Who he said this is from a black owned brand y'all so a lot of my stuff is from black owned people because in black owned young girls keyword young girls in the butt per se that girl because who am i that girl she said her supreme bag brings her good luck but just to let y'all know that supreme bag costs more than your mother's rent always something cheap on us but then it's always a little bizarre that costs the price of bitches rents so always make sure you respect us oh oh y'all now, now she want to wear the shades now she want to wear the shades y'all now she want to wear the shades i think we both got that group chat on D, &D which is why we're not receiving a text so i'm gonna get back to y'all when we probably in a car probably not mm. but probably when we at atv right bye <laughs> We are here at the Calabari, whatever, rainforest, and it is drizzling a little bit. The view is nice. Um, this looks like it's gonna be a vibe, so hopefully, it really do. And yeah, um, we're trying to figure out where we gotta go for the ATV, actually. So, oh, I see horseback riding sign, and they say ATV, you gotta keep going straight, so that's what we're doing. It looks, it looks really nice. So, let's keep walking. Y'all, it really was pouring and your girl got a wig on. I can't. Y'all, so we currently just sitting here waiting. Our thing started at 1.30, but they said to be here 45 minutes early for what? I don't know. Oh, I think he said, because it's like an orientation thing. But we here literally just waiting. I'm sure my shoes probably going to get dirty, but I don't really care. That's why I bought them. I bought them literally the week of and got express shipping, so I don't really care. That's what they meant for. I have on my track shoes, because y'all know I be running and going to the gym and stuff, and doing hikes. Yeah, so, Kia wanted to wear her foam runners, but these bikes honestly do not look safe to wear foam runners, and they also said wear closed toe shoes, but you know, some people just don't listen. Not us, but others just don't listen. And it just, these are real bikes, like some shit you could really fall off of. I have seen professional drivers fall off these. So, I don't think it's safe to ever wear rubber or anything on these bikes. Like, I'm a little scared. And it's raining today. Yeah, that's also a thing. And it's raining, y'all. It's drizzling. It's, I don't know, it's a little weird. Like, when they rain, it pours, and then it stops the next second. So, we're going to have helmets, so that's good, because my lace got to stay intact. But other than that, boom, I'm just a little scared for my wig. Like, I'm scared. But let me show y'all the ATV stuff. These are the little ATV stuff. I wish I could zoom in. Maybe. I don't know if I could zoom in, y'all. I don't know. <laughs> These are my poor shoes now. Very aesthetic. But y'all gotta watch later, and we gonna see. Oh, y'all wanna see an old TD, right? So I got on my Adidas. 
Got on my Telfeezy, making it look easy. Got on my black owned brand. Got on my shorts. We got on my shorts and stuff. Like I already said, we got on our they. L O R V A E. <laughs> yeah, y'all know how Tiara say. That's what we got on. I might actually get a photo right here because it's just giving a photo because we're in the rainforest. I'm about to take a photo right here. Y'all, I got some clips on my phone. That was so fun. The food was good. Y'all can see when I insert the clips from my phone. The food was good. The slushy was good. The vibe was good. All of that was good at first. At first, we were scared, y'all. But it wasn't that bad. It was actually really good. Now, that was a 10 out of 10. We about to go get some more. Probably something to drink, because it's hot as fuck. And then, go horseback ride. Y'all, um, we had, again, we had so much fun at the ATV ride thing. We don't start horseback riding until 3.30. And it's literally 2.45. So probably by like 3 o'clock-ish, we're gonna start getting ready to take our photos before we get on the horse. I'm really not expecting high standards from a horseback riding, but I mean, it is what it is. We don't get dressed that fast. We don't get dressed that fast, so yeah. Well, some people get dressed in like five minutes and stuff, but I know, I know us for real, for real, we, we need time to get dressed. So, and we gonna need time to take photos. So yeah. Right now we just vibing out. It's a nice breeze right here. Good water. Stay hydrated. My wig is sliding on this side, y'all. But it's cool. It's cool. My wig's sliding, but it's cool. It don't fucking matter because I'm still a badass bitch. And that's on your mama. Y'all, we are about to go horseback riding. And yes, I am sweating. This hot is fucking here. And where's horseback riding? Oh, but you want to take the photos out? I'll take your photos. So, y'all, kids want to take some photos right here. Are you ready to go horseback riding? Yep, no. I'm a cowgirl. I'm not. Uh, the best part is the ATV riding thing with the food. It was just so, so delicious, and I really, really want that again. Definitely the slushy. I just need a double bag on the slushies, like, right? I really need the double bag. And it's just so hot, so hot. You know when you get hot, so hot, and it's that, like, heat, and you're annoyed? That's right now. So anyway, I'm very. But I'ma catch y'all. I don't know if we can record on the horses because I gotta keep my hands on here. So I'ma catch y'all probably when it's over with. Okay. Y'all, me and Kia are We're gonna get off early anyway, y'all. So it's not, it just really don't matter. We're gonna end. They told this horse to go right here, girl. I'm like, where the fuck is this bitch going? Mm. Bye bye, y'all. Many hours later. As y'all can see, we are back in the house, y'all. Horseback riding was so boring. Like, I just won't do it again, ever. Never. Not even in my own state. Horseback riding was boring and very uncomfortable. We did get good pictures um, from the horseback riding and ATV riding. ATV riding, like I keep telling y'all, was 10 out of 10. The best thing. Like, that was so fun. Although the, uh, the bike thing was heating up and it was burning. But the ride itself and stuff was just fun. I don't know. Maybe because I like driving in general. So it was like a fun experience. Got a Shirley Temple. That was really good from them. Pretty sure. I think all the food there is good. I did not try all the food. I just tried that one place. That's at that restaurant. Well, not that restaurant. At that rainforest is great. Um, It was really hot. Like, it was just so hot. So after this, what is time is it now? I got to charge my phone. And it's 5.33 p.m. Um, we have a reservation at seven o'clock for this restaurant. It's a burger restaurant. So hopefully it don't fill us because it's a burger. Like how can you fill us? It's a burger. And they have some pretty cute drinks. So hopefully they is what we expect. Cause everything on TikTok that been telling that's like the top things that people do in Puerto Rico, everybody recommend it is not the height at all. And that's why we just need to stop. And even I will the person who be picking us up and dropping us off and stuff, she even said, like, yeah, the best foods and stuff from out here is probably, like, the little small, little, small, little foods, like, in a little small, little 
in the cut stores and stuff like that but the thing is we haven't even walked around and like explored none of that we literally been ubering on all of that so yeah um, so that's really what we what we got planned for the rest of the night is go to the burger spot then we're gonna come back then we got a nightlife with the girl who be who been um being our driver uh so hopefully the nightlife is fun we're gonna do club hopping she is very experienced with that so yeah i can't wait um yeah, I'm about to take a nap, y'all, because I'm so tired. So I'm going to take, like, an hour nap and then get up and then throw in a quick outfit. Yeah, I'm going to get up and throw in a quick outfit. Because then nightlife is at 9. We eat dinner at 7. And, yeah, there's nothing else planned. Do I miss home? I do. ATV had me in, like, a little, like, I don't want to go home. I hate home. But, nah, I miss home again. I miss it hey y'all so me well i just i didn't wake up i woke up like probably like 30 minutes ago probably at 6 20 as soon as my alarm cut off i woke up but we about to go to dinner like i told y'all um i think we're definitely gonna be on time because the uber is already ordered it's literally like two minutes away but we got on something calm i got on this necklace and stuff like that because i was gonna wear my orange tail beat but i didn't want to wear that because it's like i'm doing too much orange let me show y'all so this and we work our way down. Fruit sandals, fire dress, her gold neck chain, her rings. She got on her heels. She's ready. She's definitely ready for dinner, y'all. Uh, we about to head out, y'all. I'm glad my phone got charged a little bit. And yeah, honestly, the trip is going by pretty smooth. So let me show y'all. Zero minutes. So we're heading out. Now, bye bye. Y'all, we are currently waiting at Burger and Mayo. It's like a 20 to 30, 20 to 30 minute wait. So we're gonna wait because we learned that lesson the first day. If you just wait for your reservation or whatever, they don't do reservations, but it'd be a wait time. That's dumb. I don't understand them. But we're currently waiting. The chairs are nice. And yeah, so that's what we're doing. Y'all, we've made it into Burger and Mayo Lab. So I'm just looking on TikTok to see what type of stuff I want. Yeah, that's how I find out what I want to eat at any restaurant. Y'all, we are back in the house. That food was so good. I wish I could go to sleep right now, but we gotta go enjoy our nightlife at like 9.30ish. back in the house a little early yes we are because um we went to d stroke t-mobile as y'all can see and they gonna say that my outfit that could my outfit wasn't allowed talking about oh i'm showing skin and this that and third like that's what you do to a bad bitch i honestly think they just can't handle me in that park so that's why they really did not want me in there and i was fine like they could have just been up front and said that but they said I my my uh skirt and stuff just was showing too much, but you really cannot see my behind unless you're looking dead at my booty. 
But this, I kind of expected somebody to say something about my outfit, but not Distro T-Mobile. Because if you're from, like, New York or whatever, or if you've ever been in New York and Times Square, that's how it is. Or you could just look on TikTok how it is and literally everybody be jamming this and after. I have on, like, a beach skirt, meaning, like, a beach cover-up skirt. So this is really a part. This part is really to um, connect to a bathing suit. But I wasn't wearing no bathing suit to no nightlife. Like, it just wasn't happening. So they said I just couldn't go in. So... Me and Kia honestly just sat there, ate ice cream, waited for the girl to come back because she got to be inside. But when we let her know, we let her know that I couldn't go in, so she came. Then she said that she was going to take us to Old San Juan to do like bar hopping and all of that, but sure. Old San Juan only had one parking lot and she said it was too full, so we could not do that. So hopefully tomorrow is a way better day because that's where I expect some more fun to be at because ATV Ryan was really definitely fun. I will definitely do that again if that's what I got to do. All Puerto Rico to have some fun. But we're going to that exact same spot tomorrow to do like the rainforest thing that everybody always said that's fun. Everybody always said that's fun. So I'm excited for that one. But that's really it. Because I'm really over the night. So I'm about to get in the shower. Try to move my lace up a little bit. I don't even want to move it up. Because if I take this off, it's done for. I'm about to just tie it down. That's it. That's all. That's all I'm going to do. If it comes off tomorrow, that would be good. Because I'm getting it done Tuesday. Bye, y'all. See y'all in the AM. Good morning, y'all. So it is currently 8.46. I just woke up like probably like. Literally 20 minutes ago, I woke up, um, brushed my teeth and all of that, and just honestly woke up and came to realization that I don't feel like dressing up no more for this trip. Because after what they did yesterday, um, trying to turn me around saying that I could not participate in the activity because my outfit was see-through, I just said bump it. Like, I don't, yeah, I'm not going to do that. You want to go to breakfast? This is di directly what I'm wearing. I'm wearing my tank top, my pajama top, and I'm wearing my, um pink skims leggings because this is literally the only thing i have when somebody try to like correct my outfit it make me just lose my whole like that really gets to me so i'm just i'm, I'm ready to go home <laughs> like i'm ready to go home but yeah i'm gonna catch y'all probably when we about to probably leave out for the uber or whatever i'm about to let you know i'm ready our reservation is for 9 30 it's now it's 8 49 actually on a dot it just switched so yeah I miss home. <laughs> I miss home, nigga. I miss home. So, see y'all in a few. Hey, sis. We made it back home from breakfast. But the breakfast was um good. It was definitely good. It was basically like a regular hotel complimentary breakfast. We booked to go there again tomorrow for 11.15. Because tomorrow was our free day. But... The food was good. Like, it was good. I wish they served, like, dinner. And we had got the all-you-could-eat breakfast. And if y'all here, I'm out of breath. It's because we ran up the stairs because we were scared. Yeah. Y'all, I'm so tired. Like, I want to just go to sleep and sleep all day. I don't even care about the rainforest. I don't care about nothing. I don't care about nobody. I want to go to sleep. Here, we gonna, we're going to do a story time in the next video. Y'all going to see a story time of our whole experience in Puerto Rico. And we're just going to spill all the tea and let everything out our horror story okay horror story in puerto rico since everybody likes story times we're gonna do one for y'all we're gonna spill everything kia probably not y'all kia probably not i'm gonna spill everything for y'all straight up and i don't care with screenshots and all yeah and that's on period but i'm gonna see y'all later maybe if we ever decide to do something later but bye y'all i love y'all if y'all made it this far hey y'all um I probably look bad, but we about to go to um, Pino's Beach or whatever to get some street food and just take some beach photos. And then we're going to come back and then we're going to go to Old San Juan just to explore just a little bit since everybody said we just did not explore. That's what we're going to do. And then at the Old San Juan, we're only going to be there for like a little few minutes. Let's see. Because we did go to Old San Juan already several times, but we're going to go there again. Probably take a picture right there by the I Love You Puerto Rico song. Because that's what we just did not do. And then we're going to go to our dinner reservations. It was actually at 10, the dinner reservation. But our plans for today did not go as planned. So I tried to, um, I made another appointment 
a reservation for us for an earlier time, which is at like 8.15. It's at the rooftop, so I'm excited for that. Hopefully, their food is good. Um, as far as bathing suit, this is what I'm going to wear. I'm going to show y'all. So, I'm going to wear this little cover-up. This two-piece bathing suit that's off sheen. These green sandals. This jewelry. Um this jewelry right here these are supposed to be earrings they came from sheen but they small as fuck so i do have these ones just in case um and yeah and these are the sunglasses really cute really tropical really fun looking i love the colors and all of that i'm gonna catch y'all when we probably then getting dressed or about to head out or something see y'all in a bit Wake me and your child, and then won't play today. Make me wonder who you might have been playing with. Makes me wonder who you think you're playing with. I'm just a myself to keep playing this. Back and back. Oh. Hey y'all, we're back and we're better um i'm really upset because my wig is really sliding back i just can't wait till my hair appointment on tuesday but we're gonna finesse these pictures i got trust in my friend that she's gonna finesse these pictures with though y'all can't see the lace fall back um and i can't find my group right now neither so i don't even give a fuck q are you gonna finesse them whereas though they can't see the lace i got my glasses on so worst case scenario i have my glasses on and they not gonna be able to see shit so um yeah um, we about to go to the Pino, Pianos, Pinos Beach, however you pronounce it. Sorry if I didn't pronounce it right. And we honestly, we're not being in the sand, but we're going to like try to get like some sand little photos or whatever. But we're not like laying in the sand, like about to relax at the beach. That's not happening because we already found something on TikTok and it's not that safe. So, and then we're going to get some street food. Hopefully they take, hopefully they take apple pear or whatever y'all. Child at the beach, y'all. We at Pinos or whatever, and we at the beach. Yeah, we seen mad street food, y'all. So we probably gonna we gonna take some photos and then get some street food. Over and over again, sweat change, but I know it's the end. some french fries so hopefully they drink are good we went souvenir shopping those are kids souvenirs so when we we were sticking at the pack said 3.99 each but it was actually 3.99 individually so the lady told me myself was 120 <laughs> i'm like boo you was deep like what you mean 120 so, <laughs> so y'all i had to like take all the braces off but i was so mad because them shits was so cute all of them was cute but i ain't spent 120 on nothing all this trip so i wasn't doing that on no souvenirs at all i'm gonna see what type of drink i want then i'm gonna get back to y'all when we about to order or probably about to sip it and get y'all a little review because you know our, our reviews don't lie for sure they don't it's good boy but we're going back home because that's our cue we was already aiming to leave at 7 o'clock anyway, 6.34, so we might as well. By the time we get back home, it's probably gonna be like 7 o'clock. I'll see y'all when we probably get back home or something, y'all. Hey, y'all. We made it back to the Airbnb. We about to head out to dinner. Um, I got on, y'all, I'm really not even feeling it. Like, I just wanna, so I ain't even really accessorize my outfit how I'm supposed to, and the accessories is literally in my face that I'm supposed to wear with this outfit. Let me show y'all. They right there. <laughs> but I'm not playing no more. <laughs> So, this is my top with the shrubbery, um, me skirt, jellies. I got my jellies. And, um, welcome to a dog's world. Yeah, after dinner, we coming right back in the house because, yeah. <laughs> but, y'all, yeah, I'm going to see y'all when we probably heading out. We're about to be at the restaurant and shit. No cap. Long say, long say. Y'all, we at the rooftop. Um, way up high. Y'all, that's what I got to eat. And I'm a little scared because I never tried. Like, I don't know what that is. 
but I looked on TikTok and it's like a bunch of cheese. Like just um cheese and rice. But it looked like pudding. So I don't know. I hope the texture not weird or whatever because if it's weird I'm not gonna want it. If y'all don't like something, they not returning it at all. You're gonna have to just pay for that other thing that you want. Like so it, this is too fancy now, but they got lobster, so I know for sure I'm gonna like the lobster. I know I'm gonna like that. I'm waiting for the food. I hope and pray I like it because they do not cheap. So I pray I like this shit. I'm not trying to waste no money. I fuck around and go home and like I don't even care. Change your way, cause my house is not a home with no Y'all, the food is okay. It's not bad. It's good. Well, though, I ain't waste my money because I'm eating it. And Kia pretty much ate hers, too. She said it's okay. Like, so the food did get better. I already it like a 6 out of 10. It's not fancy like how we think, but it's okay. We're going to catch out when we have him back home. Um, we basically done. This kid food. So, catch y'all in a little bit. Hey sis, it's Capri and we're back. We just got back in the house from the rooftop restaurant. I'm so happy that we back in the house because I really, 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 really just want to get in the shower and just relax. We don't got, we don't really got to do anything tomorrow. Like tomorrow is just our own type of speed in the sand. We don't got to wake up early for nothing. And I'm so happy because I just want to relax and go to bed. I already got my pajamas out. It's my little um tank top set with my shorts and I'm wearing my um. Victoria's Secret panties, y'all. Yeah. Or my Victoria's Secret. When I go to sleep, I spray perfume on myself. So, my favorite perfume scent when I'm like just trying to be chill and I don't want nothing too strong or nothing too like, you know, heavy. I always use my pink sugar because it smells just like cotton candy and it smells so sugarous and it's just my personality. So, yeah, I'm gonna just get in the shower, y'all, and really relax. My wig is coming up, so I'm already will wear it. Without further ado, I'm going to catch y'all probably in the morning because right now it's currently 10.02. I don't know if y'all can see it, but it's 10.02, so I'm going to catch y'all. Uh, my name, so man, This ain't no time for acting. This ain't no time for games. This ain't no time for certainty. This ain't no time for blocking your phone and not coming home. This is not four years ago Time escapes and I forget how it felt when this shit moves slow I come through these whips that make the young boy take the long way home All my young people Time for me to go home, no cap Like, I don't even play like that I don't play with gnats, ants, bugs, flies, fruit flies Kids, none of that. I don't play with nothing I don't play with nothing, like My anxiety starting to race I don't play like that Whew. Thank you, Kia the next day Day four. I, let me tell you, I slept so good. But basically, what we're gonna do today is honestly get more photos than our last two sets of bathing suits. 
go explore old San Juan by ourselves and that's really it like I really want to go back to the Ola Ocean front thing we do have a reservation for that but it's at 11 o'clock and then for our actual natural breakfast on our itinerary which is like cause house or something like that it's at 11 o'clock as well so I don't know. I'm going to see if Ocean, Ola Oceanfront have a reservation for like probably like 11.30 or some shit like that. Because I really want to go there. Like the food. I love hotel food. That's one thing I do. Like I love hotel food. And I'm looking at the um the cause house thing. And it's just like I don't really like it. I don't really care for it. The restaurants here. And they inside like one of them houses. Like the aban that look abandoned or whatever. It stinks so bad, and the food just really don't be good, like, at all. Like, I'd rather go to the hotel that we was at yesterday, and we, like, it's all you could eat. It's literally all you could eat, so you know for sure you're going to want something from there. So, TikTok and stuff, but the food looked good for every restaurant on TikTok, and it really wasn't. So, I just wouldn't know. I don't know. If you're looking for a breast spot in Puerto Rico, yeah so that's that i'm gonna probably like convince kia because we really want photos at the ola ocean front but we must have a reservation there so like they have a nice view or at the ola ocean front y'all yeah you gotta have a reservation in order to you know experience the view so i'm gonna just after that because some, oh, somebody just rated it a 7 out of 10. Not all that good. So I'm about to just see what Kia want to do. And then I'm going to start getting ready. I already know what I'm going to wear today. So, yeah. Okay, y'all. So the fit for today is this. This, wait a minute. It's from Jada Collection. These sandals from Steve Martin. These are expensive. Then I have my little accessories. This is my little purse, my little clutch. It's like a seashell. You can see my necklace, <clears throat> and this goes to um my clutch. Many hours later. Hey y'all! So me and Kia back in the house. We did eat. Um, the food was alright. It wasn't that bad. It was hot as fuck, and. I was over it. Um, I think Kia could agree. It was really, really hot, y'all. Like, hot. Hot. One thing about it, I do love my steak. Because although I would weather bipolar, girl, I, like, I would weather do not compare it to this. But the potatoes and the potatoes is good that I have. And the coffee, it was all right. And Kia had, an, um like, two or three strawberry lemonades. <laughs> She had two strawberry lemonades and it was so that mean that it was good. Um, right now we just chilling because we just chilling, y'all. We needed some air, so we're gonna take more photos there. I don't know if she's getting changed because that was her goal, but I still see somebody just sitting down and get changed yet, y'all. So, yeah, I don't know if she really changed yet or she just y'all know she real delusional. Y'all gonna learn when y'all see her more on vlogs, she's definitely really delusional, but. Right now, the both of us is really just writing what we got to say to um the travel guy. And we're going to definitely, if we have time, put out a story time. Probably, we're probably going to film it when we get back home or something like that. We're probably going to go somewhere and then film it in our updated cars. <laughs> yeah, updated cars. We're going to probably film it in there. And yeah, because I, I, I know I got some stuff I want to get off my chest. And I want to bring awareness to people to not book that person. And I think Kia will want to as well. So... And when I chew people up, I'm chewing them up. Let me show y'all how much I typed so far for Miss Girl. For safety reasons, I'm going to send mods when we um at the airport because she do know where we live at. We don't know they laws and stuff out here, so we don't want to be done with trick on our sleeve. You know what I'm saying? So we're going to send it when we get past the airport and near our parents since we're kids and people like playing with us. That's fine because we have parents who come ten toes, never motherfucking fold about their kids. So be prepared. Be prepared. Y'all be prepared for the story time, and she better be pre be prepared to get double the motherfucking trouble because neither one of our parents play, all right? One way or the other, we're going to get our money back because our flight got delayed like two or three times. I think 
three actually like it was supposed to we was actually supposed to leave at like early in the morning like seven and then they smell smoke so we're good and they could only refund back um exchange us give us back like up to three hundred dollars for transportation and something else transportation and something else we just gotta keep all our receipts which we have every receipt because our transportation was that lady we have every receipt every receipt when we get back home we do everything texting her the insurance people we know everything only thing that was good about this trip was the airbnb we definitely gonna give him five stars what do you think here yeah, five sure. stars we both slept really good in here which was shocking because neither one of us like airbnbs like i don't i don't like airbnbs i prefer hotels over airbnbs but if i don't have to choose nothing i prefer home like i li I just like um hotel breakfast and stuff like that but we slept really good we didn't get bothered no noise no nothing the air was booming the shower was hot the light good light quality tv key was watching story times and netflix clearly Everything was good in here. He even had an iron, cause that means he came through for key. He even had an iron, y'all. So I will, if I could, I don't know if people do like that, but if I could, I would definitely leave his link to the Airbnb down below so y'all can book it. He's really cheap too, really, really cheap and affordable. Um, yeah, it's really small though, like really only for two people. But this was good enough for me and Kia only because we're scary, girl. We would have heard one noise, one droplet, one something. Girl, we both would have been in this bitch peeing again. So, <laughs> this was good enough. And it got a patio. We probably enjoy the patio when we come back from Ola Oceanfront. Because I ain't enjoyed the patio yet. Kia did go out there and got locked herself out. But she only went out there for like two seconds. So, we probably just enjoy the patio um, later. And then we leave first thing early in the morning at 3.45 or something like that. Hopefully, the plane don't get delayed or none of that. Because the... Uh, transportation girl did say all the flights over is getting delayed out here so I, I remember I remember so we could okay we're gonna bring that with us and we could probably get changed in Ola because it's the hotel we go get changed with Ola so yeah because I really just want to get pictures in all my bathing suits um Kia want to get pictures in every fucking outfit her brunch outfit her dinner outfit her this her that I ain't, I ain't even pack enough for all of that I just pack nice bathing suits that's why I make sure all my accessories for my bathing suits are blinged out and my nails go with this outfit, so I'm going to chew this outfit, and this outfit is from, wait a minute, fuck you talking about, my girl, my Libra sister. So, as far as me, what influencer I remind myself as, probably Jada, definitely Jada or JT. I remind myself of JT, because I'm arguing with any and everybody, and I, got, I do got a smart mouth, and the fashion as well, like JT love her accessories and all that, and Jada the personality and the style like i'm like a mixture of them two together i do act like ari too but i'm not gonna call nobody broken <laughs> but i i do act like ari because ari ari be me mugging and all of that i act I like ari and jt really mix 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 as far as fashion definitely jada that's me but attitude and personality jt and ari like really oh let me show y'all the um our souvenir items that we had got let us show y'all what we got from this what i got and then key is gonna show y'all hers in a um a shot glass so this shirt and then it's like this this one is a size medium so i think i got this for my uncle and this one is a small i had got it for my little sister so we just walk around and they was three for ten and then this one is a large i either got it for um my uncle i don't know if he were medium or large because they boys or one of my one of the males in my family I, I got this for them kia got shirts and jewelry and all of this extra stuff y'all i only got a couple of things like it's not even that much i promise y'all it's not that much okay i just got this shirt for someone for my brother this shirt for my mom this shirt for um i honestly don't even know who this shirt is for. um i think it's on my aunt <laughs> i got this shirt for me and then i do like kids shirts for like the kiddos in my family yeah oh wait yeah that's it just, just a little son son nothing major yeah she got a postcard for college 
Yeah, I'm gonna hang this up in my room. Y'all, we trying to get Kia to get on her Zoom, but she ain't really trying to get on her Zoom because she do dorm and stuff too, which would be a great experience because she do go to one of the top colleges, if not the one, but she just a little camera shot. I keep telling her she a little camera shot, so. Other than that, we about to just chill, vibe out, get the air, catch the vibes. See y'all in like a few hours. Three hours later. Yo, we about to head out to go to Ola Ocean Front, and we about to eat, cause I'm hungry and she hungry. I hope they food good. Well, the breakfast was good to me. I love hotel food, so I don't care. But I hope they dinner is good, cause I don't know. He come in two minutes, so we about to head out. Oh, the Tesla? Yes, y'all wearing a dark gray Tesla, <laughs> cause we're them girls. Hi, um, the pen is 6917. Every time we come here, we really just like the view. Like, it's really, really fire. I don't know, it just there's luxury. You could come here with your man. And yeah. Like you could even you can eat and get in a pool and all of that. Like that's really a vibe. Well, I was looking at the view. Oh, you like the view? Mm -hmm. But she didn't want to come here earlier. But we about to look at the lunch menu, see what we want. And yeah. I, what type of drink you have from here yesterday? Shirley Temple? We had apple. No, what did you have? Oh, the Shirley Temple. It was good, right? Wait, from here? I didn't get the Shirley Temple. I had the apple. Oh, okay, okay. That was breakfast, y'all, so we don't really know. I thought we had the Shirley Temple or something. I know, I remember I had coffee, but I thought I had juice. Cranberry, y'all had. That's why. <laughs> Y'all, we are on our flight back home. They literally delayed it three times. We're finally on this bitch. But I want to hurry up and get out of this area because it's going to rain again. And I don't need no more delays. So, yeah. It is currently 4.42. We were supposed to leave at 3 something, y'all. And we just never left at that time. But... I'm just happy to be going home. I'm ready to go and I got my hair appointment today and all that too. I'm ready to fuck the girl.